Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What is the NPS formula? To understand the Net Promoter Score, NPS formula, let's start with the foundation of what NPS is. NPS is a metric used to measure customer satisfaction and loyalty by asking a simple yet powerful question. How likely are you to recommend us to a friend or colleague? This question is answered on a scale from 0 to 10. The scoring system. The responses to this question are categorized into three distinct groups. Detractors. Scores of 0 to 6. These are customers who are unlikely to recommend your product or service. Passives. Scores of 7 to 8. These customers are neutral and neither particularly satisfied nor dissatisfied. Promoters. Scores of 9 to 10. These are your loyal customers who are very likely to recommend your product or service. Calculating NPS. To calculate the NPS, you need to follow these steps. 1. Collect responses. Gather the scores from your customer surveys. 2. Segment responses. Separate the scores into the three groups. Promoters, passives, and detractors. 3. Calculate percentages. Calculate the percentage of promoters and detractors relative to the total number of responses. Minus percent promoters, number of promoters, total number of responses 100. Percent detractors, number of detractors, total number of responses 100. Applying the NPS formula. The NPS formula is straightforward. Net promoter score NPS equals percent promoters percent detractors. This means you subtract the percentage of detractors from the percentage of promoters. The result is your NPS score, which can range from minus 100 to plus 100. Example calculation. For instance, if you have 100 customer responses with 70 promoters, 10 passives, and 20 detractors. My percent promoters, 70 for 100. Now 100 equals 70 percent. Detractors, 20 for 100. And 100 equals 70 percent. 20 percent equals 50 percent. Interpreting the score. The NPS score gives you a clear picture of your customer satisfaction and loyalty. A higher score indicates more promoters than detractors, which is generally positive. While a score of zero is neutral, a positive score above 30% is often considered good and scores above 50% are excellent, though this can vary by industry. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.